So we go from Detroit to a service center on the Ohio Turnpike. Right yeah, so we're in Ohio. Yeah, take this crazy ass road trip. And I found a new thing I haven't had before, so I had to film it. It is Taki's popcorn time, as is the tradition. All right, ready? He has one. Look out, world. That is definitely Taki's flavored popcorn. That's not bad. It's not bad. No, I mean, seriously. I really don't eat hot stuff. But, yeah, it's, Takis know, are kind of spicy on the spicier side, but they're not, it's like... Got nice, it's got a nice little kick to it, yeah. for sure. But, you know. <laughs> He's having a second one. <laughs> now it's time to get back on the road and go to the Harley-Davidson dealer where we got the guitar. We stopped and got some lunch at Primanti Brothers. Good stuff. And it's time to ask Ivan, what do we do now that we're here? Thankfully, he had just the ideas. So this is the Dukunsn incline like uh, trolley weird. thing. Definitely different from Disney. Yeah, it does not say Disney and it is not Disney. <laughs> yeah, it does but, not. Uh, we're going up a big fucking hill. And I'm really curious to see how awesome this is. Seems pretty awesome. Everything here is really old and they made me purchase the fare in dollar coins even though it was like 10 bucks. So, like, this is like a big red trolley. And it's got like a locking door and stuff. Pretty neat. Wooden seats. <laughs> I don't know what kind of roller coasters you've been on. This is pretty mild. At some point, we're going to pass this guy. I don't know if they're tied together or not. And they told me it's Duquesne, Duquesne station, and the Duquesne incline. I'm gonna do this walk around in the machinery here. You can see there's like pulleys. Wow, this is sweet. This giant pulley and a big gear. Holy cow. It has not come to play. Emergency motor, 10 horsepower. Electric motor. Here. 
This must be the main one, 75 horsepower. Installed in 1932. Neat. Can't go out here, but great views. Right now we're underneath where it comes up. Oh, we're gonna see it run. I'll bet. This I think is where the pulleys come up to reverse to go back down. It's like one big cord it looks like. And the try these carts probably counterweight each other. Here we go. Starting up. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. This is so neat. So it looks like this cable goes out over here. Goes to this pulley. And then it looks like it reverses. I suspect it goes all the way down. Yeah, that's what it says. It goes all the way down, and then back up. And then this is like a take up spool of some sort. And then it comes back down. I don't know, I'm not a mechanical engineer, but this is really cool to watch. to hit just the right point. This is not one, but four Bowden Spacelanders and just all the bikes that we saw while we were there. Just an incredible amount. It was shocking. Those are Harley Davidson bikes and just bikes after bikes after bikes. There were two floors of bicycles of various types even ones with wooden wheels, penny farthings, and like the wooden wheels there. 
There are millions of bikes here. There is just immense, just rooms that look like this that go on and on and on. Uh, yeah, that and is the cool. ceiling, they're on the floor. There's rooms, there's multiple floors. Well, literally two. everywhere. But still, you've never seen this many bikes in one spot in your life, I guarantee it. It is Ooh, utterly crap. absurd. Even the bike from Pee Wee Herman is there. Billy Bass. Freaking wow. This is crazy. Right? And this four seater bike from the monkeys, even. Now it's time to pose with the guitar outside. What a great backdrop. The guitar we came to get. And it's time to rock. Neither of us know how to play. Another few hour drive home. And it's time to play with the kitties. That's it.